Hi, this is Nate Miller from Proving Ground. In this tutorial, I'm going to go through a couple of very basic setup techniques to get up and running with the Conduit plugin for Grasshopper. Conduit allows users to define parametric heads-up displays and dashboards using the Grasshopper interface. Uh, the result is a series of widgets that can be populated on top of the Rhino viewport, such that as someone begins to update their parametric model, um, the data related to the parametric model uh, will become updated in the viewport. So you get this kind of very rich experience of having data overlaid on top of the model to give you feedback on things like key project metrics and key performance indicators and things like that uh, as you're modeling and iterating on your computational definition. Um, this is a very basic uh, setup of a couple of bar charts that are populated with some some random data just to kind of show the the interaction so you can see as I'm rotating and spinning around the model inside of Rhino um, these remain static and projected onto my viewport it kind of creates a, an interesting overlay effect and so as you start to design these dashboards you can start to really compose an interesting um, interface um, that adds another dimension to your to your modeling just to give you a quick overview here, you can see that there are a couple of uh, setups as it relates to laying out the dashboard. I can start to control things like the, the width of columns and the, the spacing of columns, um, spacing of different charts um, on this grid. Um, I can you know, start to scale these, these chart widgets in different ways. Um, and then as I go through the definition you can see that I've got different setups here for how I'm projecting different curves and text to the viewport, how I'm defining the actual bar charts themselves with, with different data, and then ultimately projecting them to a heads-up display. So I'm just going to go through a really basic uh, from scratch setup on how you can do something very similar and hopefully you can take uh, these basics and um, build out your own uh, definitions.